I never really took the moment to think about balloons as art. But holy, holy, holy good God, we found it. We found art upon art. Treb Henning, legend in the balloon art making. For the Olympics and stuff? Inaugurations? Crazy to think about how much this dude... He just, he just loved his little balloons. Yeah, I like this, the Disneyland games. It's crazy. Now we go into the, the glass house balloons. How do we fix the latex problem? We modernly refer to it as the bubble balloon now. Yeah, here's a good video of this lady doing it. And so they introduce it to uh treb and treb's like i want to i need a balloon big enough to put a mickey balloon inside and they're like what are you doing I like to pack a lot of snacks on the road trip. Well, it's more than just the road trip. You know, I gotta have food when we're at the actual place that we're going to. Cliff bars, lots of them. L little snack crackers, got them. Gotta have your fruit. Got the apple, got some oranges. I only brought three apples because we're gonna be there for like five, six days, including travel. And I'm like, I should bring more apples, but I know I'm not gonna eat them. So like, I'm just gonna bring three. Like if I have one and there's only two left, then I won't feel as guilty if I have like one and I brought like five. Anyway, here's, I brought, I'm bringing a lot of candy. We've talked about my road trip uh, escapades before and I like to have a variety of little, little candy to eat. I really hope I don't eat all this candy. I probably won't. I don't even think I'm gonna eat half of the stuff that's in here, including the apples and oranges. Cooler. Lots of Mountain Dew. You know I gotta have that Mountain Dew. And water. I am gonna have this and another bottle, and I'm pretty sure I will drink both of them almost every day. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm what we call a water fiend. Reusable straws. Lots of reusable straws and cleaner. Reusable multiple fork-spork uh, combo. Got three more of those in the car. I think we're, we're doing it. We're definitely doing it now. It's official. Really gotta wash this car again. This is like the third time I've washed this car, like this month. Pollen it is out of control. My car looks like it's a different color. I, I, I can't be having that. Thanks to these guys over here. This onto the car. Now the car is like green. Are you nervous? Do you know where I'm going? You know I'm not gonna be here? You gotta take care of everything, you're in charge. What do you think about that? Hmm? What do you think? My wife found her old Game Boy Advance. 
And I find I found my old copy of Tetris. Still works. So, T minus a couple hours until we leave. It's about 2.40 in the p.m. on April 20th, Thursday, Thor's day. It's my lucky day, Thursday. And I will be leaving with Dan tomorrow a.m. at between 4 and 5 a.m. So, a little more than 14 hours away. And we are traveling to Florida, the great, crazy state of Florida. Pray for me if you're into that. I will be praying for myself, and I don't even really pray. So that's how scary things are in Florida. Anywho, people move or magnet on the car. Nerves, my nerves, uh, escalated. You know, I'm leaving home. Worried about the dogs, worried about the rabbits, worried about the turtle, worried about the house, worried about the wife. You know, things that you worry about when you go away on a trip. We're also just gonna be doing a lot of work. And I don't know if I should cross my arms or I'm just kind of sit, Let's sit like this. You know, it's a lot of work. We're gonna be filming on Sunday and then on Monday, I'm not going to tell you where, it'll be a surprise. I can't show you what we're filming on Monday just yet. But my goal is to try to edit some vlogs while I'm down there. So on Saturday, I will try to edit the road trip down, which happens on Friday. Sunday, I will also, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to put something together but maybe on Tuesday, I'll be able to put together something that we did on Sunday. And then we'll have to wait to see what we did on Monday, because I don't want to ruin it yet. People have been speculating what we're doing. Some of them are kind of right, but there's still a lot more to this adventure that nobody has figured out yet. So that's very exciting to me. Here's another one of my water bottles. I'll be bringing. Yeti. I love to drink water. I really do. It's, it's, it's good. Uh, but yeah, today I'm just kind of putting the things together, playing Tetris. Packing the bags. You can see down there the collection of camera bags and stuff that I'll be bringing. Another crazy thing that I just discovered is that Dan may be flying back by himself and I, be, and I may be driving back by myself. So I'm going to probably vlog a lot to help maintain any little speckle of sanity that I have remaining after this trip. Vlogging and filming uh, the trips kind of help it go by a little bit faster when you're doing stuff by yourself. So iPhone, check. Not the Game Boy. Game Boy's staying here. Mm, maybe I'll bring the Game Boy. No, I'll keep it here. Mm, no, I'll keep it here. Action camera, DJI Osmo Action. One, Lumix, GH5. People always ask what kind of stuff I film with. Well, I film the GH5 and with this camera right now that I'm filming on, this is a, uh, this is a Sony FX30. New wireless microphones, multiple ones. That way Dan and I and other people we invite on our trip will have a microphone to talk into. 
not sponsored by Comica. People should sponsor me. I think I'm, I'd be an amazing spokesperson for your brand or your piece of plastic that you're trying to sell. That's well, a very good microphone. Yeah, all the other stuff, it's just like microphones and like, it's not very pretty to look at. So it's just, you know, microphones and, you know, little camera accessories and just the stuff that I don't probably need, but I'm going to bring it anyway. Speaking of, I should bring my purple pillow because hotel pillows, trash. Let's just, let's just say it. They're the worst. Delicious. Lavender lemonade snow cone. See you tomorrow morning, bright and early, between 4 and 5 a.m. in the morning. And yes, I just found out there's a 4 a.m. in the morning now. <laughs>